Hello guys, today we will talk about how to use uh, Mendeley Reference Manager to cite our articles or uh, manuscript or thesis or any book chapter. Uh, this is useful especially for PhD student and other research scholar, um, those who are in the scientific community. Uh, it is freely available to download and use it. Um, uh, it is a good software. And, but uh, in order to use it, you need to sign in with uh, your email address, um, with any of your email address. Uh, and it is a single sign-in. Uh, so you need, if you have an algebra account, then you can access all of it because this software is developed and maintained by uh, Algebra, um, Algebra Incorporation, a publication uh, company um, based in uh, Netherlands, I guess. Um, and so let's download um, the Mendeley software uh, and then try to install in the Windows uh, system. And uh, we will demonstrate how to cite an article in a doc file. So let's go to, uh, well, let's download uh, the Mendeley and install it for ourselves. Oh, Mendeley, not the web importer, we'll talk later. Mendeley reference. Mm. Yes. So this is their website. So you need to sign in in order to use it. You can download it first, but ultimately in order to use the web, Importer, you need to sign it. So let's download first anyway. So download for window, it automatically detected your system. So accordingly, it will be downloaded. Okay. Now it has been downloaded. Go to the download. Mm, no. Double click or otherwise right click and run as administration. Click yes, and you can only use for yourself or all your that's up to you. You can, it doesn't matter. So, okay, finish. Yeah, so now I have one. So this institution email ID creates me a problem. I don't know, maybe it is out of my network. Right now I'm sitting at my home. That's why, so I will use my personal email ID which I have used it uh, during my PhD. So I maintain my data over there. So this one, then you need to type your password. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Uh, if you don't have, you need to create it actually, so so I already have it, so I don't need to create it. So you will, it will pop you up anyway. So yeah, so I already have the database, so it helps. So it says to restart it, so in order to update to the latest one. Okay, anyway, let's do it. Okay. Finish. So here, if you want to add a PDF files, then you need to do add new here, click. Add new, import file from computer, import file, folders for computer. So either folder or a file, you can uh, import it or import the entire library. So now I need only a file to be imported from my computer. So I need, I want to include these two. This is a book actually, so let's go. So it will appear here. Later you can segregate into group because earlier my public and no feedback. I have the manuscript, so I have it and then we use cam. So here it are destroyed. No reference in this section. Oh probably I don't know what happened. So the trust is if you de delete anything, it will be here. If there are any duplicate, uncensored, publication, 
Uh, you can put all your publication here. You want to put favorite, you can do recently view, recently read, recently added. So, and all of them it will appear here. So one recently added. So already one is added. Okay, the another one has appeared now. So this is how it will appear. So let's, okay. So this will look like this. So it will appear here, read the information, add authors. Uh, this one is the author name is, you can add here. Bird English. That is the author. Here I know it is two forms and one. One, I don't know, day, I don't know, city, institution, whatever. Yeah, okay, then. Read. You can. Anyway, it will take time, so let's not do it for today. Okay, it has come up, see? It's quite <laughs> nice. So you can read at the same time here. Yeah. Close it. You can download it. So, info. Read to it, zoom in, rotate, fine, then you can close it. So you close it. So this is the Mendeley. So if you want to cite it, I need to cite them. So for that, let's try to work import it. Uh, mechanically prime, I already have been nice, really, that's good, okay. A family of hyperpolarization activated channels selected for protons. So, uh, let's put in the web importer. Mendeley. Mendeley web importer. Uh, so here, yes, you need to sign it. Get web importer. So before we do it, let's sign it first. Uh, okay, I have already signed. Now Daniel can. So I can go get web importer for Chrome because I'm using the Chrome. Add to Chrome. Add extension. Now it appears here. So, so that it may be visible, so pin it all the time, it will be visible. Now, you refresh this one, yeah. Now, this business is done. Now, you click it like this. <laughs> Taking okay, so you can select either of these. So, if there are many other paper, whichever you want to cite it, these are related paper, you can just tick mark them and it will do so. Uh, or you can even choose your folder. This library, I have NO feedback, I have VDC cam, JPCB that was published in 2001, in Journal of Physical Chemistry B. Okay, so now I, I just want to be in the main library, so I click. Add. It is still going. Let's see where it appears. So it has been added. So let's check in our main folder where it has been. Um, let's refresh all references only. 22 FM. Oh, it is here. This one, the first one. Yeah. 
processing of national right all the information are there annotation is no person notebook not yet info okay so this is how now it's everything is opened now how to cite it so you need to open a doc file either dot doc or dot docx both will work so i already set up here this file manuscript sample i already have some of them so let's see how it works so ambiguity in the getting mechanism walters dependent on in channel this is the uh, draft just for a so in order to sign uh, let's take an example Okay, we want to cite this area. So we put our mouse cursor here. Now, in order to cite, you have to go to reference. So now my Mendeley is not connected with my Word document. What do I do? So in order so that, because it has to appear in this references tab. So the tabs appear, click bibliography, insert citation, all the equipment are there, but our Mendeley reference manager is not still connected with our uh, Word uh, software. So what do I do? So go to home, then you will find add-in, okay? Click on add-in and scroll down. Okay, Mendeley site is there. If it is not there, you can search on the search bar. It's easy. So you click add. So now it appears, the Mendeley site. It will, so um, you can a little bit increase. So it's up to you. You can, because now it is your word file. You can either, um, close let's close it for a while so you can decrease this one and then let's open it so in order to cite it so you need to log in again so get started it will ask you to sign in again see so now oh this is not what I want. Uh, try another account because this account doesn't work. So I need to type in the email with um, Daniel com, and then continue, then password. So sign in. Ta -ta -ta -ta. Now it will work. So now take a tour on it. If you want, you can. Get a support done. So all the references are here. See now where it was here. So whatever it is here, whatever it is here it will show up here see calcium ion channel we just added earlier right and the uh, family hyperprice we just added it so let's say i want to cite this one at this position right then i click here and you can select as many as you want then i click on insert citation this is how now you want to click another one click a bino molecular eukaryote you can click on channel excitable membrane you can set so insert save changes yeah so all that so you can delete it either if you don't want so let's say I don't want this um this guy. So then save changes. So it's from here. It's very nice. 
So this is how you can insert your reference manager uh, using reference manager and where it will go this uh, we have set up at the bottom so if you are at the so if you want to put the below the bibliography or the references you have to put your mouse uh, mouse cursor at last or for this maybe i have already created it so let me delete this for a time being so that I can show you how to put so I delete now I have to put my cursor here the references so in order to put so what do I do I click on uh, bibliograph hmm. see references insert bibliography there are no authors in the current document um, wait what is the problem wow. Maybe. For sure location, yeah. Yes, this is how it works. Hmm? Okay, so we need to go here. Then insert bibliography, more options are there. So it has been, oh, it has been different from the earlier. My profile, Lonzo two. anyway, you can check out yourself. So in order to insert our research, so let's do it again. Let's do it again. Let's do it again. So, you put your mouse cursor wherever you want to insert. So let's do it at last. So let's try, the, I want to put here. Then I click this one and then insert bibliography. Then uh, your bibliography will be inserted at your cursor location. Yes, it gives you warning. So in order, if you did any mistake, then you can, so now, yeah. This was our citation. So this is how citation will work and how you can cite it uh, using Mendeley Reference Manager. So you can increase. Um, so everything is connected actually. So Mendeley site is a separate app to which you can Earlier we used to do from here, we insert the Mendeley software, but now they have completely re replaced with this button. So if you go here in the insert, you will not find the, the tab anywhere. So you have to either come to reference or even you will not find in the home also. So you have to come to the references in order to find the thing. And then to, in order to add any add-in, go to home tab and then you go here Add any other, to, to, if you want to add the Grammarly, Editor, English, Maths, Type, and anyway. So you can do all this thing. And in the next video, we will talk about how to use, how to add, how to insert equation, symbols and equation. So you, it's very, very nice. If you are not a program user or a, who knows coding, uh, because we cannot use the, uh, the code to write uh, the, the, this one. So we need to use the MS Word and it is quite convenient for us. Uh, thank you for watching. All the very best. Uh, Tata, bye-bye. See you in the next video.